Marzano is a cozy Italian restaurant on Park Boulevard in Oakland's Glenview neighborhood. Monatecchi is the owner and general manager. Hi. Hi, how are you? So tell me a little bit about the history here because I know it closed in 2014, but then reopened in 2016. Yeah, I've been here since 2008. It opened up as a tiny little uh, neighborhood restaurant. In fact, it was only this side um, and it became very popular very quickly. And it had a great run up until 2014. I was the um, general manager at the time. Um, but it was time for the previous owners to move on and it gave a chance to myself and my business partner who was the previous executive chef of Marzano to partner and buy in the business. I mean, it was almost like a dream come true. And what are, would you say are some of the most popular items on your menu? Yeah, so definitely our pizzas. The Spanish octopus is amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a little bit on the spicy side. And the wood braised chicken is our signature dish here. So a lot of Oakland businesses have been struggling lately. It's been a really difficult time. Tell me about your experience. Business has been down across the board about 30% this year. And then you add in vandalism and break-ins and uh, you know shortage of staff. It's just been very stressful um, year. Tell me about the recent number of break-ins because you said three back-to-back? -back. Yes. Uh, first time ever that we've experienced break-ins are this year and three times back-to-back. -back. Uh, the most recent one being two weeks ago you know, 5.30 in the morning, very quick, very damaging. Um, we missed about $7,000 in cash. Uh, safe's been, been stolen. Um, doors broken into again and again. Our privacy has been broken. Our trust has been broken and it's just not a good feeling. So how, how do you move on with, from all of this? It's an ongoing conversation. Um, you know, we have to engage our community. We have to engage our uh, city leaders. We have to engage our uh, police department. Um, I think it's a long road, um, but I'm also very resilient. So I won't give up <laughs> unless, you know, I've tried everything in my power. So I, I do believe in this community. They've showed us support. They've came here and they, you know, with flowers and, you know, with support. And so I feel like I have to put up a fight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, business is already down. Yes. And then this keeps happening. How does it affect your, the business as a whole and you personally? Um, honestly, we're not, at this point, we're not in it for the money. It's what's keeping us going is the love of the community and the love of this place. Uh, we are the very fabric of this community, and I think we deserve a chance to fight. Thank you so much for talking to me. Yes, thank you so much for having me.